welcome to this week's video blog. Um, this week I'm going to try something new and um, hopefully fun. Um, it may, like, I, I'm entertained by the idea, so, um, hopefully you guys enjoy it as well. Um, the ladies of Outlander have worn some very interesting outfits over the years, and, um, you know, I just, I want to start off by saying that this is not meant in any sort of mean way. Uh, this is just my thoughts on some of the outfits that they've worn. Um, I love, like, even if I don't particularly like a particular outfit, I love that they have um, fun with fashion and they make interesting choices and I love seeing their uh their different tastes kind of show up and 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 I just find that very very entertaining so this is just me sort of giving my thoughts on uh certain looks that they've worn over the years um I try and give like a, a there's an like an overview of like all like um we're talking about Kat and 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 Sophie and um, Laura Donnelly who plays Jen Jenny, um, Lottie Verbeek who played Galus, and um, Nell Hudson who played Leary. So we're going to sort of be covering those women and the different outfits that they've worn and giving my thoughts on them. Um, again, this is just meant in fun. Hopefully, you know I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I'm just trying to be you know funny and entertaining and hopefully you guys will enjoy as well. So with our first look we have Katrina Balfe uh, looking like a um, lawyer who slept in her outfit because she is that determined to win the case. She slept in the courtroom and she's just that much of a hard worker and this look is what she was wearing. Um, next we have Kat, and apparently it was my kid made my shirt day, um, at school, and, uh, so she wore this adorable shirt that I find very amusing. Um, yeah, it was my, my kid made my shirt day at school, and she, she was, she's very proud to be wearing that shirt that her child made. Um, and this one, she looks like a very sort of demure, um, put together young lady who has come to watch your kids and will kill you in your sleep. She looks like a demure serial killer. Um, moving on to Sophie, this outfit, she looks so cute in this outfit. This outfit looks like she's a teenager or a young college student on her way to her first job interview at a big corporation. I, I adore this outfit. This one, she looks like an adorable s'more, like a, a, like the food. <laughs> she looks like the chocolate top, the marshmallow, the you know the the graham cracker top and and the graham cracker bottom, um, and like the little marshmallow in between. She looks like a s'more, and it's adorable. Um, oh, this one, she looks like. She's trying to get into the sorority, so she invites the head girl over to her house for tea and has poisoned the tea. She's going to kill the sorority girl because she wants to be the, the, the head sorority girl. That's what, the, that's what this look looks like to me. Uh, now we'll move on to Laura. Jenny Marie has become a flamenco dancer. 
I love this top. It's so pretty. But she looks like a flamenco dancer. And I like it. Um, oh, number two. Flora looks like every Portuguese mom who has had enough and is about to go grab the chanela. Portuguese for slipper. Or the wooden spoon. Or the broom. Or the cable switch. Cable cord. Or any sort of projectile she can find to throw at you and beat you with. That's what she looks like. Uh, number three. Oh. This one is a... She looks amazing. I love this look for her. She looks like she's going to take over the drug cartel and her mob guys are waiting outside to murder you. That's what that... That's what this look feels like to me. Um... Next, we'll move on to the lovely Lottie Verbeek, who played Galus. Um, this one, she looks like that uh, scandalous teenager who shows up at prom with the dress that's a little scandalous and everybody's looking at her. I love this dress. I don't think I'd have the guts to wear it, but I love this dress. Um, this one... She looks like the prettiest doily ever. That's just a beautiful doily. <laughs> um, this one, it's such a beautiful dress because, but she's hiding the fact that she's so mad because she stopped at an Italian restaurant before she got to the event and they spilled pepper, black pepper, all over her. But she's trying to make it work and I commend her for it. Uh, next we're moving on to Nell Hudson, who played Leary, and she's here to paint your house. Uh, this one, she came to the event or uh, she's leaving the event on her motorcycle and is about to go off and get a tattoo that says Jamie Fraser sucks. She's probably going to get it on her ass. Uh, and the last one, Nell Hudson looking like she's going to have an affair with her piano teacher. She looks like that heroine in, in every book that, uh, has an affair with her so much more sophisticated and mature piano teacher. She's that girl. So that was just a little um, overview of some of the outfits that these wonderful ladies have worn. Um, I hopefully, like again, no no offense meant. This is supposed. This was just meant to be uh, a fun little. Uh, overview of um, my thoughts on some of their um, interesting choices. So um, I hopefully like you guys enjoyed it and uh, we'll do some more of these if you guys um, enjoyed them. Um, that'll be it for this week's video blog. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash author ejamie. Like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash author ejamie and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.